Hi, my name is Paula Rock. You're welcome to my new YouTube channel, Crochet Made Simple with Carrick Designs. My shop Carrick Designs is on Etsy, Amazon and eBay and I currently sell all my handmade items. I've set up this channel basically to show you that with or without a patron, everything can be done, just as the title says, very, very simply. Some of the items I've currently made would be hats, bun hats, we have headbands that is a self tie for anyone especially with dreads prove very very popular the aim I have for this shop is to show you how to do things free with affordable yarn hooks and that you can either sell your own or give them as gifts or you do decide whatever you want wear them for yourself I do a bit of everything and I make it as fun as can be the main aim of this first video is just to show basically what I'm hoping that I can teach you we have a little baby dress, all made up from my own mind. I have it in a couple of colours. I love nice, fancy colours. That's the other one. And I think there's loads of yarns at the moment. The, some of the good yarns, the Karen, the Tivoli, all them cakes are really, really good for that because you don't have to keep changing the yarn. That's a self-stripe stripe yarn. So it's really, really good. I have vests here that prove really popular too. I can't, I'm not sure the name of the yarn. You can comment below and I will look for it. As you can see, if you want to have a look, oh, some of my wool stash, my children have said that they might put me on hoarders, but I don't think I have enough. Some of the other stuff that I'm hoping to show you as the time goes on with the videos is, this is actually a free pattern I got online from Drops. It's a square. It's actually just, that is just one crochet square and I have made four, five, six, it's eight squares in total. And it shows you how to, uh, actually that's my own, pa it's drops pattern, but it's actually my own design for this sweater. But you can get it, I can send you the free pattern. And then it literally is eight squares, folded to shoulder, comes here and it's absolutely beautiful on. I have done a few of them in the different colors. I've sold some, but this is actually mine at the moment. The next video I will be doing will be to work on a lace effect effect stitch. As you can see there, it's a twisted stitch. I'm not sure the actual name because I, as I said, I'm a designer. I make most of this stuff up. This is my sweater that I've made up. It's a small crochet. How many do I have for my size? One, two, three, four, five. For larger sizes, you'd probably do six or seven. And then all you do is pick up and I'll show you how to do the twisted stitch. That twisted stitch is my favorite stitch. I use it from everything. I have it here. This will be another pattern that I'm going to show you, talk you through in the further videos down the line. Again, it's the twisted stitch. I have knit this sideways and then just added the sleeves and added a little cockle shell border. Very, very popular again. This is a basic hat pattern. You just do the one, two, three, four increase rows, a normal row. And again, the twisted stitch really, really gives it something special. And of course, I'll be doing a video again that shows how to do the hats. We have more. I have the stitch here, the twisted stitch for a rib. So I started sideways to fit the width of a woman's head. So we only have a repeat pattern of one, two, three, four of the twisted stitch. And then you pick up and you leave the hole and then you have it. Great for kids, great for school, great for running. I used them, I'm a jogger. I used them for running the whole time myself. Get to the babies. These are more plain colors than I'm used to. I love fancy, fancy colors, but these are other people's choices. These are actually going out on an order this week. Again, it's the same as the larger hat that we have here, except it's a smaller amount of stitches and increase. And then we have it there. And we have that in a different color and I can give you all different sizes. So basically the first video I'm planning on showing is the triple stitch and we're going to put up, I'd say multiples of five and we're going to just, I want you to know the stitch inside out before we get too technical. So the next video when you hopefully subscribe to my channel now will be that triple stitch and then we're going to work on doing a scarf. So for the next few days, after you, if you subscribe to this, the next video that comes out will be, I'm going to talk you through this stitch. We're going to do the scarf. And then once you have it done that, you know, it's all the one size. You don't want it in, out, zigzag. You want it perfect. Then we can start getting technical and we'll probably start with the baby's hat like that. And then in the following video, I'll show you how to do the hat. That's just a two tier flower, but we can do three tier 
fourth here and then then along the line this is my own hat pattern for I'll just take that off that's actually hang on that's for my my shop I had just my tag on it's a beret that I've made up it's a mandala beret that proves really really popular it can be worn fold it down or you can actually just wear it straight up as a beanie rather than a beret. If you turn the edge at the back, it can hang more of a slouchy look. These are really, really quick. It takes me approximately, I'd say, an hour and a half for that. And if you're unsure of people's heads, especially when it comes to sizes, when it comes to the beret, the best thing to do is you do a chain. So I'll be showing you just do a long, long chain. You start at the back and we basically just weave it in and you tie it underneath so it's hidden. So then you're guaranteed a perfect fit. Great for Christmas gifts, absolutely fantastic. So at the moment, I just have this. This is my first video for the channel and I'm hoping to set up a Facebook page so you can leave comments. And if you need anything, I will show you here. If you want a free PDF pattern that you can print out, that's no problem, you can get in touch with me. If you comment below, when, once you subscribe here, um, I will know that you're looking for a PDF pattern. So I hope, Thank you very much and I hope you'll join me and in the next couple of days I'm going to get started on the twisted stitch as I call it and I hope you'll all join me and let's have fun over the next few months. Thanks for joining.